Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Heidi and on this video I would like to talk a bit on L'Occitane's face cream. Now to not get confused, L'Occitane has like two face creams that have like the same packaging. Uh, this one's called the Ultra Rich Face Cream because it has 25% shea butter and the other one is called Shea Light Comforting Cream because it has 5% uh, shea butter. And also the cream is a bit lighter. It feels almost like lotion whereas this one is thicker and it feels like, like a thick cream and um, it's described on the website to be for dry to extra dry skin but I don't have um, dry or extra dry skin my skin is pretty um, I would say mostly oily and acne prone and very sensitive but I wanted a moisturizer for myself and decided to try this out because I have lots of tin fragrances and I really love them and I think they're like one of the best fragrances out there and so I decided to you know venture out and try some of their skin products because I've heard a lot of good things about it and um, so far so good I really like this it has not break me out I didn't get any rashes it didn't irritate my skin and that's always my concern when I try any makeup or skin products anything that goes on my face my biggest concern is is it going to break me out is it going to irritate my skin because my skin is very sensitive and it's just prone to all of that mess so I'm really happy that it worked out with this cream and it's really it's really hydrating and the smell it does have a fragrance so just be worried of that for people that are so just be worried of that for people that are sensitive to smells and don't like smells this definitely has um, I would say a light powdery smell to it I like it I enjoy it but some people of course don't like those things but yeah and also since the cream has 25% shea butter it is really thick and really moisturizing and a little goes a long way now with that said since a little bit goes a long way it's going to take a long time at least for me to finish it like I'm like at least Now I have had this cream now for about three months and I have used it off and on and uh, really like it, enjoy it and like I said a little bit goes a long way but I guess that would be like the con is that this cream has an expiration date and the expiration date is in six months so all of this cream I've only used like one third and so I'm three months in and I have another three months before this cream expires and so I'm busy and just slathering it on my face my chest I might even have to use it on my body because it's a lot of cream and it's very thick and moisturizing but um that would be my only con is that it's um, the expiration date I wish it would last at least a year or 18 months but six months for all of this cream and being that it's so rich and really moisturizing like I don't think you're you know you're gonna finish this whole jar in six months like no so that is my only con but other than that, it's a really good product. Um, did I say it also, it currently retails for $34. And um, in Sephora, you know, if they have sales, which, you know, they always have some type of sale in Sephora, you can 
go ahead and pick this up but it's a really good product and it's you know for me that I have sensitive skin it didn't do anything like it didn't break me out so I'd suggest to try it or at least get try to get like a sample and try it out and you'll see for yourself that it's really fantastic the only um, con to keep in mind is that this cream expires in six months and so you have to use it um, yeah because you don't want to waste your $34 and you barely even made a dent so right now I'm just you know putting on myself and like I said I might have to put it on my body just to finish it and use this cream up but yeah that was my little review on this fabulous cream and thank you guys for watching don't forget to rate comment and subscribe and if you've tried this cream let me know how your experience did it work out for you did it did it work out for you did it not work out for you um let me know uh see you on the next video guys bye bye